Right. So you've been here two weeks, right? Yeah, I started in nationals and then yeah, that was a it was a pretty good meet. Started the two fly, how to get two fly, and two back. Prelims, I still felt the block, so I made the D final. So I couldn't make the junior pan pack team, but I still had a good swim at night. And the rest of the meet was pretty good. And I got to the two back here at juniors. And then I went in third, and then I actually won it, going to uh, oh. <laughs> uh, 159 0, which is best by over a second. So I was really happy with that. It was just, it was a, overall, it's been a pretty good week. Yeah. What uh, what were your expectations coming into it? Thank you. Uh, I really wanted to make the junior pan pack team, but obviously didn't make that, and I'm just gonna move on. Hope hope for next year and get better and everything. But I do get to go to the youth Olympic games, which I know isn't like the biggest deal, but it's like still gonna go somewhere else. And then yeah. yeah what um, are you going into your senior year? Yeah, obviously. Um, have you committed? Texas. Texas. Okay. Yeah. How how do you, how do you feel knowing that going into your senior year you've already kind of made that decision? Uh, it just takes a lot of pressure off because you don't have to, like go and talk to a bunch of coaches and everything and you can focus more on training and just you know you're like you're like set in stone to, or not set in stone but like you know you're gonna go and it's just it's just good to know. Yeah. Do you so so how big is your club in Montana? It's not. It's like maybe 150, so it's not too big, but it's it's, just, it's one of the bigger teams in Montana. Okay. Do you do you have training partners? Uh, I mean, on freestyle I kind of do, but backstroke is not even like I my backstroke I usually race the freestylers, and I can yeah. <laughs> what I mean, what has that been like for you? Just kind of doing it solo for quite a while. I mean. It's just, I mean, we have, we're all friends and everything, and just good to race, but like, definitely don't get good training partners. I mean, we have good training partners, but it's like, it'll be better in Texas and everything, have people to race and everything, so yeah. Was that what drew you to Texas? Was that team? Yeah, and also, yeah. And also, their major is really what I want to do, so one of the biggest majors there, so. Yeah, yeah. what is that? Uh, engineering. Okay. Yeah. Uh, where'd you get those shoes? Oh, I'm you gotta buy them. <laughs> <laughs> They're pretty nice. Yeah, I really like them. <laughs> so, I'm just asking, kind of for personal, like, what has it been like growing up as a swimmer in Montana? Yeah, it's definitely not a very big sport in Montana at all, so... I mean... Yeah, it's like... It's just, it's definitely harder getting into fast, getting fast and everything, just because... You don't get much recognition, like... This year I'm actually starting to get a little more, but it's like it still hasn't been much. What, what do you do for fun in life? Uh, hiking, biking, rock climbing, all this. <laughs> <laughs> okay. yeah. So you're an outdoors person? Yeah. <laughs> what What are you looking forward to the most? Just getting to Texas and Austin. Awesome. Uh, just good people to race and more training partners, more friends. Just having a good time. Are you friends with Catherine Burkhoff? Yeah. Yeah? <laughs> Does everyone in Montana know each other? Yeah. <laughs> We're all friends in Montana. <laughs> Montana's kind of just one big team almost. That's kind of cool. Yeah. Uh, thanks, Ethan. All right, yep.